Hello viewers of Wasteland TV, we are here with today Kenny James, voice of Bowser. Voice of Bowser. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The enemy of Mario. That little guy right there. He's not that intimidating compared to the life-size real version of the voice. <laughs> yeah, as he sits right here. Yes. So how did you get the uh, part of Bowser? Oh, man, right place at the right time. Uh, I was working my regular job. Somebody overheard me talking about doing voice work. I had a demo made. They passed it on to the studio that Nintendo works through and uh, started getting auditions, and one of them was Bowser. So, are you the original Bowser? No. No. There was a, there was actually a human voice actor before me. Uh, his name is Scott Burns. Ah. And uh, right after Super Mario Sunshine, they recast. Still don't know the reason why, but they, they recast. And uh, I got it. <laughs> <laughs> like Sandro Nelson over there with Darth Vader. He's the second, what's the second yeah. body? Yeah, yeah. One of the vents. So, Sorry. how does it feel to do Mario uh, Mario games and being Bowser, the villain for all these years? How does it feel? It's uh, it's painful. <laughs> <laughs> how come? Uh, it's just the voice. Is yeah. the is the voice kind of like a squeaky voice? Uh, no, for... no, everybody knows what that voice sounds like. He sounds like. <laughs> oh, okay, the deep. You gotta do the deep oh, gruff, yeah. Yeah. gruff it's, laugh. It's the... Yeah, it it can get painful after a while. But... So, how long is a recording average studio of Bowser recording? Two to four hours depends on. What That's why your voice gets rough then. Yeah. Especially yeah, since you, you're a soft-spoken person. This one right here. <laughs> what is that, Mauser? It was a cat power-up. Oh wow! So it was a combination of Meows or Meowser is a combination of a cat and Bowser, and it tore me up pretty good. Because you had to come up with a voice for it. Yeah. Yeah. It was fun though. <laughs> It was especially fun to find out that it got approved. <laughs> I didn't have to do it again. Because uh, do they do a lot of, uh, like, do you do the voice and they go, no, let's do it again? Well, yeah, I mean, there's some immediate feedback from the directors, uh, but then everything that I do gets approved by Japan. Okay. So, Is yeah, it because I'm, of the script or the everywhere. way you said it? I'm, I'm not just Bowser in America. Oh, I'm wow. I'm Bowser everywhere. So you learn multiple languages to read no, from? No, I, I don't see, he doesn't speak English. <laughs> Okay. Or I mean, he doesn't speak Japanese. Okay, so he always speaks English? He doesn't speak it much at all. Okay, he just growls. I've said four words in English. <laughs> what are they? In 15 years. Uh, Showtime, Mario, Peach, and Nintendo. <laughs> That's pretty much it. The rest of the time, it's Bowserese, which is, you know, gibberish, basically. So, so what is uh, Bowserese sound like? So, if well, you haven't he, heard, the audience just, hasn't heard yeah, it. Yeah, it's just gibberish. It's... <laughs> That's it. So, any other uh, type of characters you've done? You know, I was just, we were just talking about that. I've done, I've done a bunch of Spotify work. Uh, it's not characters, though. It's, well, one of them was. But, you know, it's just pay the bills kind of straight stuff, you know. Uh, I did do a character for a mega church in North Carolina, I think it was. Uh, it's a little character for their kids program that tells Bible stories. <laughs> and they're real From brief. Bowser to Bible stories. From Bowser to Bible stories. And his voice is like, hey kids, you know, today we're going to talk about this thing and da -da 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 -da, and so and so did this. And so how hard was that voice to hold? Uh, it wasn't too bad. They're, they're, they were all short. Even though I recorded most of them all in one big blast, I did those from my home studio and emailed them to them. Oh, wow. Yeah. It's good work if you can get it. So do you do a lot of cartoon work, or do you do... Uh... No, not right now. Um, Bowser's been... My meet and date has uh, been not so much for pay, you know. But, uh, I mean, I maintained my day job for 10 years after getting Bowser. So, probably more than 10 years. Uh, and then I started coming out and doing cons, and which has gotten me a lot of networking, and so I'm branching into anime. Yeah, I heard you talk about yeah. that anime. Have you anime done any anime is, yet? Not yet, but I live I live there now. <laughs> I live in Anime Town. So. So one day you hope to be a lead character in an anime? Oh man, it might take forever before I get some kind of big part, but 
I mean, I'm happy to do additional voices. Or even know? get a Power Ranger monster. If I get... <laughs> <laughs> if I, if Last I get year, they had Lex Lang here in it. <laughs> if I get a character that has a name, and, but, and it's only one episode, I'm still happy. I just want to work. Kind of yes. like uh, Brian Cr uh, Cranston. Whoever, you know, who would right. expect him to start as Power Ranger monsters? Right, right, right. And, and now he's and an Oscar-winning actor. Yeah. He's also very good at everything he does. Yes. I liked, took, Malcolm, I liked Malcolm in the Middle. That, that, that was the where he was noticed, because before that, it's like he played a, a consistent villain in TV shows. Yeah. Yep. So but, what else? But yeah, so what did you... What would you say to someone if they want to get into this work? Learn to act. Practice a lot. Uh, we were just talking about that sitting right here. Uh, I'm constantly preaching live theater. A lot of people just don't want to do it or they can't do it because they just don't have the nerve to, to get do out the on public stage speaking and front of people. Yeah. But if you can do it, I highly recommend it. It's kind of like when I interviewed Caller Gobbly. He was talking about how he likes uh, casting comedians because oh, yeah. comedians are naturally imp know how to improv and they, they yeah. emote faster than than someone who's been trained to act. Improv is really important. I, I regrettably do not have a lot of training in improv. Uh, I, I think it's extremely important though. So. Uh, now I've, come, I, I've, I've lost my train of thought. That's why editing is, uh, is a thing. Oh, editing is beautiful. <laughs> but leaving the mistakes is even better because it shows that we're human. Yeah, right. I are human too. Yes, except for Bowser. Yeah, no, he's not so human. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you know, he's, maybe he wants to be. Maybe that's his big problem. Yes, he got knocked out of Amiibo contest by Sonic the Hedgehog. I, uh, I was actually, I was on, I was on uh, Good Day Sacramento during SAC Anime last January. Yeah. And they asked me, what's his problem? And I said, I don't know, he's like a misunderstood child or spoiled child. He's, <laughs> he's Bluto. <laughs> he is, really. You know, if you, if you know your car comic book cartoon history, he's Bluto. He is, actually, kind of. Yeah, I can see that. Draw you know, the, Mario's not Popeye. No. But he is Bluto. Yeah, he is, kind of. Because he's always chasing his olive oil. <laughs> so we'll leave the people with that thought. Right on. <laughs> and thank you. Yeah. See you.